Hey you guys, yes, I'm in the same outfit that you just saw me in for my purse sale because it's the same day, but I had ordered a thread up fun rescue box and it came in the mail, so I wanted to open it and see what I got. I haven't, I haven't ordered one of these in a really long time because they just haven't been the best. And a thread up fun box um, is basically like a mixed bag of a bunch of different things. Um, kind of like a complete mystery. Um, so we're going to open it together. The box is kind of smashed up. Um, this one comes to us from Mechanicsburg, PA. These boxes can be found on ThreadUp's website under rescues. And you just have to keep checking the website. There's no, like, schedule or any reason, like, to their drops you just have to keep checking and keep refreshing okay so i ordered this on august 5th and it's 10 items for 34 dollars plus tax and shipping i think for me it comes to like almost 50 bucks something like that so let's take sorry that was mom and when mom calls i answer so, I did not touch the box. Here it is. I didn't even take the top off yet. Oh, okay. So we have a little bit of a black theme. Let me see if I can hold it up more so you can see. Um, black and blue, it looks like. I don't know if they're supposed to do themed boxes, but that's kind of what I've been seeing on YouTube. This is cute. So a little, like, newsboy hat. Um... I don't think it's leather, and I don't see any tags. I don't want to put it on and mess up my hair, but that's cute. Um, I'll have to measure the circumference and put it on the screen for you so you know if it'll fit or not. But, I mean, it looks like it's in pretty new condition. I just do not think that it is real leather. It's just like a faux but really nice on that. So I'll put some information on the screen. I'm not exactly sure what this string is, but okay. So there's one. We have another little hat. This looks like a little vintage number. And there's somebody's blonde hair on it. All right, let's throw that out so that it doesn't get anywhere. And then I think it's Kyle that's leaving blonde hair and why you have, no, I'm just kidding. Um, so this has a little clip on it, so you would clip it in your hair, you know, wherever you like it, if you like it on the side, or on the top, or whatever, um, and it has the mesh and the flowers, so that's really pretty. Um, Halloween is coming, so maybe somebody would like this. We have a, you know, dual little costume here already, so I will do this one for... Just five bucks, super cute. Um, okay, so this was the little blue lacy thing that we saw. So what is this? High end design luck elf. Sexy high waist dye, and then it get it got cut off. Um, I'm going to guess it's dye high stockings. black rhinestones so if you can see through here it has rhinestones on it but how do i oh you can open it okay i thought it was sealed all right so let's let's take a little look Ooh. so i think they definitely are thigh highs they are the a fishnet a black fishnet with rhinestones so that is very sexy so maybe Got got yourself a little outfit going on right here. So um, I don't think there's a size because they're just thigh high. So I'm pretty sure they are pretty stretchy. So we will do five on these as well. Oh, another pair. Okay. So these are just like a lacy pair of black stockings. There's no tag on them whatsoever. So I can't really tell what size they are so that's kind of let's see if I can tell let 
Mm, I mean, I know they stretch. I would say I would just stick with a small, small to medium on these. Um, and we'll do $5 on these as well. Okay. Then we have this. Oh, it's a collar. I mean, is this is this a Halloween costume in a box? Because you can wear the tights, the hat, the collar. Um, this is cute. So it has a little opening on the back there, and then it would just be like that around your neck. You could wear it with a tank top if you want to be a little bit more sexy. But yeah, that's cute. Um, it's probably 16 inches. And we'll do five dollars. This is definitely a lot of Halloween stuff. So, um, ain't no basic witch. <laughs> and this looks like a collar as well. So it would go like this. It's like a pretend necklace. Um, and again, probably 16 inches. And it's by the Rogue and the and the Wolf. Um, Five dollars. <laughs> Another pair. Okay, so these are just socks. Again, these would actually look really great with this. These are a um, like a knit sock but with the pretty lace at the top okay and they're probably to the to the mid knee knee let's see um hopeless romantic victorian trading company um it doesn't really say five dollars so actually everything in here is black look at this Ooh la la Ooh la la. <laughs> this is actually very pretty. So this is by Poor Moi. And it's called the Dark Romance Underwire Bra in black and pink size. Thirty eight D. Thirty eight D and it is very pretty and it's new with tag. So again, you can literally build an entire costume. You can wear this underneath with your cute little hat. So for the really pretty pink and black lace bra, I will do $10. That's beautiful. Okay, this is definitely a Halloween box. Look at this. These look like suspenders. Are they, are we, are they supposed to be doing holiday theme boxes? I didn't know that was a thing. So we have a pair of suspend suspenders. Am I even saying that right? It sounds weird. So they have these um, like daggers on them with the skulls. So I will do these for five dollars, and it is the whole thing is stretchy and adjustable. And then we got these. gloves fingerless gloves but they have um a skeleton hand on them and i bet you they go in the dark oh yeah these you can't can you tell yeah you can you can see that they glow in the dark and they probably go up to you know mid mid forearm so those are cool this one looks like it has a little bit of a mark right there, but otherwise, very cool, $5. Wow, I mean, what? You guys, this is cool, look at this purse. You definitely have a whole outfit here, you guys. This is a, like a mouse purse. It's all like rubber. It's like black rubber. You can see like my whole desk. <laughs> um, gold tone hardware. It opens 
Aw, they even put their thread up paper in there. There's no branding or anything. Um, mm, ooh, it does. Okay, big ol' iPhone 13 Pro Max does fit. So this is cute. Again, great for a costume or every day. Very, very cute and in very good condition. Crossbody, it's adjustable and removable, but we'll stay crossbody. $10 on that. Okay, that looks like there's two more things. I don't know what this is. This looks like maybe a jewelry box. Oh my gosh, how cool is that for travel? Love that. So it is a black faux leather. This is a beige um, faux suede. And then you have all the little pockets. And then you just put your jewelry in and roll it up, snap it closed, and you're good to go. So that is awesome. Let's do $10 on this. Excellent condition. I don't think it was ever used. And then the last thing in the box is this. And it's very heavy, so I'm guessing a watch. Let's see. Yes. Okay, so it might be broken. Kyle will have to look at this because I don't know anything about watches and he knows about like all the links and stuff. Um, there is a ton of links in here and a price tag of $99. Ooh, this is pretty. Um, it, it's silver tone and the face is a mother of pearl with the rhinestones very pretty it is um more of a larger face um i will have to have him look at this and see if he can you know put the links back on i don't know um and then i will put some info on the screen for you so let me keep this out so i can have him look at that oh don't want to forget this there's a pin right there Okay, well, that was cool. So let's take the paper out and count everything. So we got the watch is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13 items. Wait, did they do that on purpose? Halloween themed box with 13 items? Lucky 13? I think it's lucky 13. I don't know about anybody else, but I mean, that was kind of cool. <laughs> so what do you guys think? It's not a bad box. As you can see, I definitely can make my money back plus some um, profits. Did you have a favorite item? Let me know. Um, do you think that someone can totally build a Halloween costume with everything in here? Let me know. And um, yeah, I guess that's it. So give me a thumbs up. And if you, um, I should have said this in the beginning, but if you see anything you like, please email me anotherchanceresale1 at gmail.com. I will put the information in the beginning of the video. Totally forgot because I was so excited to open this. Um, information's also down in the description box under the video. You can press more and you'll see the information there as well. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.